What's up guys, Flying Scorpion here again, and uh, I'm going in for uh, round two with Behemoth. Learning how to play Bob better. Uh, I just got off work. feel like playing some Evolve, and uh, well, I'm just going to record this match, and hopefully I'll do better <laughs> than I did last time, but, um, well, it takes more than two matches to get better, though. If you didn't see the last the last video, you should go back and watch it. I basically get my ass kicked at stage one. Monster. Oh, here we go. Oh, here we go, finally. Oh, I must have dropped, because I'm only getting silver skilled and bronze destroyers. It's not taking that long, actually, to get a match. It does take a bit. It's a bit of a wait, but it's not that bad. I must be silver skilled. That must be what it's assuming I am right now. I've got to be silver skilled. Because I was getting, like, silver destroyer, silver elite in the last match. So I probably went down quite a bit. Well, that's good. I, am, I really am not expecting to win again. Like, I... <laughs> even against silver scaled, I'm not sure if I'm there yet with Behemoth. <coughs> Once again, if you got any suggestions, uh, any tips on how to do better with Behemoth, even with the first abilities I should pick, I don't even know what abilities to pick at stage 1. Um, if you know any good gameplay footage on how to play as Behemoth, uh, particularly after the patch, because he's changed a bit after the patch, his abilities have changed a bit. Uh, Lava Bomb is much more viable now. I'm going to take the green one. Uh, Jade Skin. I just feel like using Jade Skin on this. I think I'm going to go with a three-point distribution, and I am going to take Lava Bomb, Tongue Grab, and Rock Wall. And uh, I'm going to, once again, take... I don't know if I want to take damage reduction, to be honest. I really don't know if that's a good idea. It does buy me more time, but <clears throat> you don't heal very much. Damage reduction is good if you're healing by a lot. Um, feeding speed could be good. Smell range. <coughs> Traversal. Um... Yeah, damage bonus is good. I think I might just take movement speed. Smell range increased by 75%. That's actually pretty helpful. We're going to take movement speed, I think. We'll take movement speed. So I don't have a whole bunch of elite players, but uh, let's see what we got. Slim's annoying, but he's not too bad. Hank, Jack. <clears throat> the good thing uh, with playing against Slim is I can throw the rock wall up and that can really disrupt his ability to heal because he can't shoot at you unless there's wildlife nearby. So throwing up a rock wall and getting uh, some good damage on someone on the other side of that wall is really going to help out with taking them out. <coughs> Plus I'll be able to cut off the beam hopefully. I might just go straight for their assault. I really might just go straight for the assault and take them out just get them behind a wall. So we took movement speed, we're going to go this way, and I might grab damage buff if I can find it if I get lucky enough. There's a wildlife, there they are. See that thing spawn right in front of me? Okay, it's not. I'm used to having two points in Oh, here we go. Oh, that's nice. Oh. So I'll be able to really tell where they're coming from uh, thanks to having the increased movement speed. <laughs> or increased uh, small range. So I can see them coming that way. I'm going to go back around, try not to get birds on the way. I can see somebody there, I'm going to pounce attack him. Come on! I'm trying to get that pounce attack, but I'm really having trouble with it. I got their assault. Okay. 
Well, I think I'm doing pretty good this time around. Better than last time. So now I'm gonna try and just chase these guys down and finish this off. Actually. Yeah, I can see them running over there. I should chase them, get some more strikes off. Go for the cutoff. That increased small range is really helpful. See them over there? Right over by my reticule? There they are. Where are you at, guys? There we go, now I got the pounce attack to work. This is gonna work out a lot better. This might be a stage one win. Yeah, that was a stage one win. Okay, I'm I'm surprised and impressed with myself. Hurt. <coughs> yeah, we wanna stay two and two. Especially in that it's a kind of a Easy choke point. One of the things I noticed during that match is I was having a lot of difficulty getting the pounce attack to happen on uh, the assault. <clears throat> if I could have gotten the pounce attack to work, uh, I may have uh, may have been able to close that out even better. But that's all right. I mean, I still won, but uh, I need to improve upon my pounce attack. All right, well, thanks for watching. I was going to cut off this video and going to start another one. And then, uh, like I said in the previous one, if you got any tips or tricks to help me improve as Behemoth, let me know. And uh, <clears throat> oh, we'll be going on with the next one after this.